All right, guys, fire away. All right. Uh, so can you just tell us how much fun today was and what do you think allowed the team to be so dominant? You know, I, I'll be honest. I don't really like these games. Um, I end up being too uh, – I mean, I like them from the standpoint of – Tonight, it was fun to see a lot of players play well. It was fun to see uh, some plays that, um, you know, you could see some growth in. Um, normally, this kind of game gets real sloppy, and you're just like, oh, just get it over with. We'd get more out of, you know, practice and, and that kind of thing. But I thought for the most part, we were pretty solid. I thought our start was sluggish. Um, didn't seem to be locked in, um, but after that initial uh, quarter, I thought things got really good. It was fun to see sides uh, really cut loose and play well. That was fun. It was. Uh, I thought. Uh, I thought. Uh, uh, Briley Glenn played well. I thought. Uh, I thought Gabby got it going a little bit. I thought uh, Jay and Serena were pretty consistent. I thought uh, Zy Walker did good things. I mean, really, everybody on our roster did good things. That's the fun part of tonight. Obviously, defense has kind of been the story this season, but now you have back-to-back -back games with the, your highest scoring total of the year offensively. What kind of – what has that development been like lately? Yeah, I, we're, we're still a work in progress offensively. I mean, there are so many areas that we can continue to improve in. Um, I think that's kind of our Achilles heel is that, uh, you know, we'll have a quarter where we shoot 30% and it's one thing to have that quarter because you're just going to have it. But when it's self-inflicted, that's more of a problem. I thought tonight's was more self-inflicted. Then I thought they really locked in the last three quarters and you can see the results of that. And, and um, we haven't done that before with the bench. The, that was really good to see because the bench really, um, there was no drop off. So that, that was the part I enjoyed the most. How'd you feel about the team's performance off the glass tonight and offensive boards as well? Yeah, I thought it was, I thought it was good. I mean, the numbers say it's good, but um, I thought it was okay, yeah. Can you talk about your prep for MU since it's like a um, veteran team and all that? You're you're saying prep for Mizzou? Yeah, um, you know, it'd be a way different way different game, obviously, and we know that. Um, yeah, um, it'll be similar to the turnaround we had. It'll be a quick turnaround. Um, be similar to the uh, Wisconsin game where we had the turnaround. Um, we'll have a light practice tomorrow. Um, not much contact. We'll uh, get through some things, but uh, then uh, really um, Friday will be a big prep day and a, and a big practice day and, and get ready to play on Saturday. Where did you feel like the biggest mismatch was today that allowed you guys to dominate? Well, obviously, Lee draws a lot of attention. So you can play off of that kind of mismatch because of the attention that she's getting. So I thought Briley Glenn really is is learning to play off of that with a lot of cutting off of her post-entry stuff. Um, I think we're learning uh, when she's drawing that much attention that there are driving lanes that are available because the help is late. Um, one of the things I wanted to do with all the attention was we sent some extra people to the offensive glass because they were using two or three to box her out. We saw some things that were good there. So um, it really starts with Lee because everybody's going to come in to every game and say, this is how we're going to defend Lee. And we need to be able to recognize how they're defending and we need to be able to, to recognize what advantages we can utilize. Do you have any thoughts on Gabby reaching the 1500 point mark? Yeah, that was pretty cool. I uh, I uh, hadn't paid attention. I should read Randy's notes. It's probably in there somewhere. Um, but uh, yeah, that was pretty cool. And uh, yeah, I thought she had a good look to her tonight. And, and uh, you know, you always want to reach those milestones when you can on a good night, not just back into them. And tonight was a good night for her. Does the 100 point mark mean anything to you? It's fun for the fans. Players like it. 
Uh, I was more excited that Eliza went to the offensive glass with 30 seconds to go and is just playing the play like she's supposed to. Because that's an area that she can really help us at. It's an area that we're on her to constantly do. And, uh, you know, um, yeah, so I was pleased with that. Generally speaking, how would you feel about the defensive performance tonight? I thought it was pretty good. I, I, the uh, pick and pop threes is an area that we're going to have to get better at. We know that when people go five wide against Lee, it's an area that we're going to have to 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 improve. And um, we'll take a look at film. But I thought uh, I thought Lee defended it better in the second half. I thought um, Imani was okay. She blocked one of them. And I thought Hev had a good look to her, so I thought they got better there. Um, but it's an area that we've got to get better at. On a similar note to the Missouri question, it's a maybe bigger opponent than you've seen recently. Just does that play into the preparation at all? Nah, I mean, we, this team's been tested. I mean, we've been tested on three games in three days. We've been tested on, you know, uh, three games in a week. Uh, um, it's one of the reasons why I do what we do is that there's not anything going forward that we haven't faced. And um, uh, we've certainly played a uh, good schedule, and uh, that's why you play it. Any comments about maybe the rivalry with Missouri? I don't know. When's the last time we played them, Randy? Yeah. Um, I know we got some Missouri kids. I'm from Missouri. Um, I think it'll be a fun game. St. Joe's, where I went to school, um, it's kind of back home for Serena, so there'll be a lot of storylines to this one that'll be fun. But ultimately, it'll get down to, you know, how we perform and how we play. And um, uh, I'm, I'm, I've been pleased with how this group has responded in preparation, and um, I would expect we'd have good, solid uh, prep tomorrow. All right, guys. Thank you.